With today, very rapid change in technology and a tiny chip potentially having hundreds of billions of transistors working at very, very high frequencies. How can we ensure that such an intricate design would work correctly before we go ahead and spend hundreds of millions of dollars and fabricate it? Electronic design automation is, is just like, let's say, a flight simulation. You don't go fabricate a chip that will cost you $200 million without killing it in terms of uh, simulation and analysis on the computer. One thing I realized in the last uh, almost five plus years is that the complexity uh, growth that we are facing in the area of uh, semiconductor design uh, resulted in, in certain gaps that need to be dealt with. Otherwise, we risk uh, producing chips that may not work properly. So this is where we identified the gap, the need in the industry, and Sweetera is trying to handle this. We're very excited about our new company, Sweetera, developing an interesting product, very important product in the area of electronic design automation. We are working very closely with the Ishmael, one of the leaders in the field. Uh, we, we're very fortunate to be working with the American University of Cairo. Uh, they've created a very innovative and supportive environment where we can really do important research and get out some important products and their culture for startups is very, very well appreciated. Uh, together, we're developing a new suite of tools. The first one of them is called Moril which actually reduce this complex circuit into much more smaller one that accurately represents the original circuit. Then you can simulate this small circuit to get all the characteristics and behavior you would like to know about the original circuit. So Moril is only the beginning. I mean, we are already developing our second tool, which is very important tool that uh, models the physical layer, as we said. So we're very excited to be part of this high-tech economy and to be part of making the future.